Hey, what's up, Poke Gamers? Um, got some Pokemon, or <laughs> got some Paradox Rift stuff. This is a new set. So we got a Elite Trainer box, as you can read upside down. Also in the other video, I don't know which video is gonna go out first or whatever. I didn't really remember to do this. I was planning to do this music box thing more often. And we got some pretty good stuff in that video if it came out before this. If it didn't, holy crap, you're about to be blown away. So let's open this. Let's open the booster box or the trainer box first. Delete trainer box. Opening it first. By gliding the scissors along. Oh, my shadow is running everything. My space is very, very small right here. Okay. Okay, there it is. You can see it, right? Right? You can see it? I think that like little red thing means it's recording, I'm pretty sure. Right? Here's the same thing again. It also comes with the little book. It just has the, it just has like all the cards in the set. And also like, I think it tells you how to play or something. It's dumb, don't worry. Oh, you know what else I forgot to do? I forgot to do this with the other box, but this, the outside thing, the outside casing has cool perch on the inside. It has like all the art from the packs. Let me just rip it up real quick. You will not be able to see this very well and I'm not gonna move everything, but it's like a little tapestry. You know, you can use it as like a D&D thing. You know what I mean, you guys are gamers. So here's the sleeves. I don't really like these sleeves that much. They're kind of ugly. Let's see the promo. I like this promo, it's pretty cool. It's very pretty. It's freaking Jigglypuff. Don't let anyone tell you any different. We got the dividers. There's what, four of them? Four or five? <laughs> Just the same thing, but zoomed in on the other side. Pretty freaky sweet. Then we got nine packs. Nine packs of destiny. Squish them down so I can scissor them real good. <clears throat> oh, let me, I'm gonna mix them up too. Mixing them up is pretty fun, pretty silly. That's good, I didn't mix it a lot, but whatever. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter. <clears throat> Sorry, I got a frog in my, well, you know. Okay, we're starting off with my literal favorite Pokemon ever, just kidding. But I really like Galvantula. Also, I forgot to take this off, forgot to take another steel. <laughs> if you watch my other video, there's a lot of steel energies for some reason. Galvantula is cool. Electro Bullet, that is freaking scary. That's freaked in the head. I like this, Mantike. <clears throat> Sorry, got a frog, got two frogs in my throat. This Mantike is cute. Ooh, Pan Sage. Another little cutie. Ooh, get that on my face. Iron Bundle, this is cool how they have this crazy, freaking crazy, scary thing over here. Like the card is going into the future. You know how it is. Piercing, Toxic Sting, Gliss Score. Very cool, future booster energy capsule, can't wait to use it. Ooh, look at this one. Very ghosty, very spooky, very scary. A horsey, that's a cute little <laughs> beached horsey about to drown on land, get a sunburn. Golisopod, oops, scaredy cat. Next freaking pack. Holy crap, 
This is a sultry blitzel. Look at him. That's look at the background too. I like how far they're going with the art in these new sets. Water energy. Stupid. Who would want to get wet? Anyway, this Blitzel is probably the best thing that's ever existed. Bound Sweet, that one's stupid, ugly, quick blow. Holy crap, this one's cool. Wow, that's like cool or something. Also, sorry for breathing in the mic. Also, sorry for no intro. Also, sorry that I'm new. This is my video. Oh, look at this one. Huh. Tatsugiri. Wow. I didn't understand what this Pokemon was when I saw it in, um, what's it called? Scarlet and Violet. Wow. I bet that one would ever get possessed and turn into a Pokemon. Medical Energy. Wow. That's cool. Techno Radar. It looks like a little game of Boggle or something. <gasps> Jirachi. That's legendary. That one must be worth like a million dollars. Holy crap, more Pico in a hungry hurry. That's cool. I like that one. Huh. It's nice to see Pokemon from all generations in the same set because I was opening a lot of 151 packs, which only have Gen 1 Pokemon. Oops, I see something on the end that's cool. Oh, psychic. I'm trying to take off the freaking energies. I don't know, maybe I shouldn't even do that because it just kind of reveals what the card on the end is sometimes. Anyways, cute little snow run to Minecraft Steve. Ugly. Um, Dungeons and Dragons. Hey, look, Simisage. Monkey Trio. If you have all three in play, Ignore all basic energy and the costs. That's interesting. Huh. I wonder if each one has a different ability that is good. Very interesting. Oh, I love Cyclozar. Definitely one of my favorites from Paldea. Flittle. Definitely one of my least favorites from Paldea. That one's nice. It's a little... Clay one. I never really liked the clay ones that much, but I do like the clay ones that much. Holy crap. Serena. Gonna do a quick blow. Just like Bound Sweet. That's funny that the baby one has quick blow, but the adult doesn't. What is this? Terra at the top? It's like a new mechanic, maybe? I don't know about it. As long as this Pokemon is on your bench, prevent all damage done to this Pokemon by attacks. Huh. Oh yeah, and it's water type. I didn't even I didn't even think of that. Cause it's normally grass type. Very cool. Put it up in a secret spot. These packs are like looser than the 151 packs. Oh yeah, I said I wasn't gonna do that. I guess I'm careful I can. Grass, energy, Phoebus, draw up power. Apom, I like Apom. Simisage, Ferrothorn, Exoskeleton. Oh, that looks cool, Cursed Duster. That's like a freaking Cursed Duster. Whoa, Orbeetle. I don't see this guy very often ever anywhere, especially in action. Yo, Zebstrika not like presenting its rear to the camera anymore. Charcadet, one of the Pokemon from Paldea. Garganical, that's how you say it, Garganical, I think. He's pretty cool, I had him on my team. The Minecraft man himself. Not do, not do. Anyways, this is my YouTube channel. Electric energy. You know, you know the works. 
I'm doing some Pokemon card openings right now. It's will never be consistent. It's just a thing that I have in case I want to do stuff. It's a cool Zubat. Kind of, I guess. Not really, actually. Holy crap. Dodonzo? Dondozo, I mean. Look at this. It's like way off center for some reason. I wonder if that's a misprint. Sorry. You can tell I'm inexperienced. I keep like moving it away from facing the camera. Luxurious cape. I would totally see. Oh, oh it's mine. Oh my God. I don't like these two Pikachu clones. That's a pretty card though. That means there's one for Plusle too. My look tick. But I'm still gonna put it in a sleeve because it's a fancy um, full art. We like to call the full arts farts here. There he is all fancy and crazy and annoying and crying and annoying that little kid. Okay, next pack. Bound sweet. Oops, I saw something on the end. Let's get rid of the code. Let's get rid of the basic energy. Bound stupid. Phoebe stupid. Phoebe stupid. I, I want Joltik. I wonder if Galvantula has a full art. That would be awesome. Oh, I love Toad's Cruel. Slime Mold Colony, that's my favorite place to live. Wow, look at this. That's the new like thing for the Paradox Pokemon. Isn't that pretty? It's so pretty. And like the future one just looks, it's just a bunch of squares. This one's like, wow. It almost looks like a full art when you're like revealing it. Me and Fu. Whoa, look at that one. There's like a lot of these type of ones. I wonder who the Shinji Kanda, Shinji Kanda. Let's see if I find another one. Oh, Goldengo. I, there's a full art of him in this, I'm pretty sure. I actually really like him. I definitely used him on my team. I think he's like really good in, the game like stats wise and typing and um attacks wise but i didn't i don't really follow that that much i just like the way he looks and i like to collect gimme gold coins aspect it's basically like the koroks in zelda breath of the wild and spoiler alert also the exact same koroks in tears of the kingdom in case you haven't played, it's the exact same Korok quest, but there's different things. There's different ways to get it. That's a cool pose for a good bite. It's an interesting angle. There's the ugly baby. The blade. The blade. Mil tank. One of the two Pokemon that have exposed nipples. Cloth. Cloth. Bike. Oh, that one's pretty cool. That one's not by the same illustrator. It doesn't look exactly the same, but it's like that colored pencil y, colored pencil -y sort of thing. It's very colorful. Wimpy. Oh, I love Brute Bonnet. This type of like ancient card looks really cool as a hollow. And the whole thing is hollow. It's not like only here or only outside of the art. Hmm. That's pretty freaking sweet. Next pack. Gibble. 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 Gable. Oh, I hope we get the other 
three evolved monkeys. Future boost. Oh, Screamtail. We got the promo of that one. So this one's stupid in comparison. Iron Bundle again. There's that fish. That freaking fish. Gable. 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 Latios. Last pack of the booster box. I mean, last pack of the uh, Elite Trainer box. Gimme Ghoul. They made it a Psychic type. That's interesting. I guess because it's Ghost. They do Psychic instead of Ghost in the TCG. Um, rock Energy. So we got a freaking Gimme Ghoul. We got a freaking Purloin. Another cat. Two cats in a row. That guy is going down freaking guts inside somebody. There's a Steel Fish. Oh, Gen 5, my favorite. Oh, Gen 5, my favorite. Oh, Gen 5, my favorite. Oh, Gen 2. That's Spartha and the gym leaders in the background. That's kind of freaking sick. This piece clearly shows the metamorphosis possible using computer graphics. 